How are we all doing? So things have been going so well with the channel lately I thought we'd have a little celebration and what better way to celebrate than with a bottle of the very finest stuff that I could get my hands on Baby Sham 5.5% only the finest for my subscribers So um I've never had baby sham before so this is you know it's all about new experiences here on the Owl Lodge Nodge channel so we'll see how it goes now what I don't want boys and girls is for this thing to go all over the camp camp because that wouldn't be good I don't know how that happened there at all it's a kind of flat oh oh ah oh, a bit disappointing right There you go. Right, cheers everyone. Hopefully I'll have a thousand subscribers soon and uh, things will get really going there. Right, now you're not to drink all that down on the one gold boiler. It's expensive stuff. So, um, I thought we'd have a look. With the Philips radio the other day, nice radio, whatever. I thought we'd have a look at those two more Philips radios I have kicking around the place. Um, one I know works and the other one I've never done anything with so I'll bring the phone in and I think we'll have a look at the one that works first and uh, we'll see how we get on with him and when I say it works I had it going about two years ago so hopefully it's still working we we'll just have to go and get a couple of batteries for him anyway a couple of batteries this one takes six AAs and it's um, a germanium transistor job is a look inside it. Sadly, I don't have the battery cover off this one that went missing. Um, obviously, at some stage in the set's life, but uh, so I usually jam a bit of cardboard or something in there just to hold the batteries in place. It has um, from memory AF127s, so it doesn't suffer from the tin whisker issues that we all know of. As you can see, it's a rather nice little set. And it's got a nice big ferrite rod. So this performs, so at least from memory I think it performed fairly well. But, um, uh, model number 18RL274. I don't know what year, but having germanium transistors, I suppose it's sort of it has to be in the sort of mid sixties at least at the latest. It's funny that they made the back so accessible, given the fact that you don't need to take the back off to change the batteries. Now let's see what she burst into life me. I'm gonna turn off the noisy workshop lights. So it's um, half ten at night here at the minute. There's a bit of a whistle behind her. Oh sorry, I'm telling you lie, we're on long wave. Touch. 
zero. So here's medium wave. I think maybe long wave doesn't sound right at all. I wonder is the wave chain switch might be dirty. Anyway, we'll have a tune around the medium wave. Well, sorted is a strong word, but how you managed to avoid complete disaster uh, over the course of the next few minutes after that. Uh, but right now, right, so that's enough of that. That's not going as well as I remember it. But um, we'll have enough with this one. This is a slightly later one, going into the 70s here with this one. And got this a while ago, never did anything at all with it. So we'll see if we can get it going. Nah, uh, the batteries are still in this one. And it has nice energizer ones, which have not lasted as well as the ever readies in the uh, the other Philips from the other day. Oh dear, lovely. There's the lady. Label. This is an RL, a ninety RL, one ten, and this was a, I think. A 90RL210, so these must be the same sort of in the same lineup. Pity the batteries are being left in this. See, the best before day here is the March 2004. So, it's safe to say it's at least 20 years since it's seen any use. Now I'm just looking down in here and the spring actually doesn't look too bad. So we'll see if we get on if we just made in Singapore as well. Lovely. I'll spray a bit of switch cleaner down on top of the spring. And we'll see. We'll see if we can get the rope without opening it up. Switch cleaner up there. Now I have 3C batteries and shove them into it. The other brand new C batteries are in this Sony Recorder. We'll talk about that another day. Disappointingly, that works, so there's not a lot to say about that. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. I'm here to try to do something. Probably wants all the capacitors changing in it. <clears throat> mm, it definitely wants the, the switch clean anyway. Oh my. No, we're not going to get away with that. Nearly, but not quite. Just the one screw holding this together and it clips together. So we'll get the little screw out and it will give the 
switch on the on the volume uh, a little squirt. And we're in. Dust in here. Oh, it's kind of stuff, though. And put a little bit in the switch as well. And my seed doesn't want to walk now. Again, I'll turn off all the noisy weights and things. Long way of starting coming in on that. There's Radio Far and Long Wave. Because we're backed by the Russian people who seem to realize more and more the countries. Well, we'll put the backpack on them. There's not much more we need to do in there. So this one I know has um, seven transistors and the other one had eight transistors. But I don't remember if the other one had a uh, detector diode in it, so they might have been using just one of the transistors or a, as a diode, as a detector. Uh, I should have took note of that when I was in there. So I'm just wondering, does the, the, uh, our larger one here have an extra IF amplifier stage in it or not? Or are they more or less just the same set? In there. So the dangers of leaving batteries and radios. Luckily enough, no serious damage has been done here. One thing I'd say about these, the battery manufacturers can't have been too uh, keen on these radios. Like this one here takes four days. This takes three C's, which I'd imagine would last a very long time. And you're seeing that sort of go away, sort of towards the late 80s in portable radios where you end up just getting two AAs, which you get about between 40 or 80 hours, depending on use and what have you. Still, yeah, another one going. I hope you enjoyed that quick little video and uh, cheers again everyone take care and I'll see you soon good luck for now